Welcome to Tech Binomial. This tutorial is about how to use the capacitor screenshot plugin. Let's start by creating a blank capacitor application. Install the plugin capacitor screenshot. Along with this plugin, we use the file system plugin so that we can save the captured image. So install the file system capacitor plugin. On the HTML, we will uh, take one uh, button on the click event of which we capture the screenshot of our application and one image uh, which display the screenshot. We import here the file system and directory from the file system API and screenshot from the screenshot plugin. Declare the image source for the image. Let me add the method uh, to capture the screenshot. We copy the code to take the screenshot. In the console, it will display the base 64 of the image. Okay, we assign it to the image source so that it will get displayed on our page. run on the wave mode so this is the screenshot on the wave mode we can save it on the save images and so check the base 64 of the screenshot So here it is in the console. Okay, we will save this uh, base64 image using the file system API. So add the code to save the photo. To write the file we provide the path that is the name of the file. Uh, then the data that is base64 of, of our image and the directory. So initially we will add here the documents directory. We will add here one alert to uh, get the path. As uh, we want to run this app on the Android device, we need to add few uh, permissions. To copy this permission, read external storage and write external storage. We will run here the command uh, ionic cap sync android which will uh, generate the android folder. Under android open the android manifest file and paste the permissions here. Run the application. So it asking for the permission on the real android device. Allow the permission. It capture the screenshot and display its path. Under documents directory we get the screenshot. Change the document directory to external storage. We run the application again and check the path. So for better understanding, we open this on the laptop. So under the Android folder, starter folder, files and here the screenshot is saved. So that's it guys.
डोंट फॉरगेट टू लाइक सब्सक्राइब अवर चैनल बाय बाय